All right, so I've got it back in working order. Uh, I replaced all of the uh, standard key pins in the bottom with uh, serrated. The only one that's not serrated is uh, pin number five because it was too short. Uh, but the rest of them, I put these uh, um, American and, and Master serrated key pins. So I still have a little bit of a tick. I looked at the uh, the core and I didn't see any metal sticking up. It only does it when it goes counterclockwise. You get that little bit of a tick. Uh, but other than that, this thing is back together. It has its five spools back in it, and uh, it has now it has a serrated. It has serrated. Uh... Oh shit! I just turned them all upside down and dropped them. Well, you can see that they're serrated now. I didn't really intend to do that. Like I said, I'm always screwing things up on gutting and reassembly and uh, that's just the way it goes with me it's never just you know like cut and dry easy it's always something but that's what happens I thought I had it completely together. That's why I wasn't filming when I was doing the key pins because I, I dropped a spring, went looking for the sucker, couldn't find him. I had to, uh, now I've really got it screwed up. I think I've got one of these key pins out of position. Looks like number, yep. That one swap with somebody else. So, I'm going to have to take this thing all apart. Well, we'll just stop this one rather than have you suffer through me trying to figure out what I did wrong.